Man up now, man up. What's up, gentlemen? It's a Man Up Monday. I'm KD Bo in the studio with the amazing voice and the personality of Todd Dulaney. What up, boss? What up, what up, man? You good? Yes, indeed. Hey, man, so we were talking uh, a little bit earlier about, you know, marriage and, and how sometimes it can be it can be a little interesting. Man. You've been married for almost six years. Yeah, almost six years. And you, But you, what you said was that there was a time in which you didn't think you were going to make it. Let's talk about that a little bit. Yeah, man, um, <laughs> the first couple of years, the first couple of years of the marriage um, were, were really, really hard. We're really, really like, uh, <laughs> I don't even know the word for it. I don't think we really connected at all, my yeah. wife and I. You know, we were trying to play the role of being married, but, um, man, it was like I wasn't hearing what she was saying and she wasn't hearing me. Yeah. And, like, I wanted more of everything, you know, and I wasn't getting that. You know, I wasn't, you know, I wasn't more sex, more time, more everything, and I wasn't getting it. And it wow. was like, I didn't know what to do to get it. So what was the so, thing that, so as you guys were communicating, mm -hmm. what would you say is the thing that really turned things around? So you you told me about a time you yeah, guys, you yeah. walked downstairs, she walked downstairs, yeah. both of y'all crying because you was about to call it we, quits. Yeah, we, we were done. So we, we sat down. And um, I'm telling you, I had prayed, cried. I didn't know what to do. And he was a worshiper at the time. Yeah, I was a worshiper at the time still. But 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 my heart for God was was different than what it was for my wife. And it was sad because it wasn't until that conversation that we're talking about that I realized that, man, this man that you are to God is not who you are to your wife. Really? Oh, man. Like, I was so, like, I'm talking about I could just lay on my face before God and worship him and read my word and, and be deep. But then when it comes to my wife, I was real short and not not like that. And wow. so when we got that conversation that morning, Talk about man, the conversation. So okay. what you say, you say, I'm going say, to sit you down, tell me everything wrong that, about that, me. that's a problem with me. And yeah. I'm not going to interrupt you. Wow. And that was the biggest thing. And she said, okay, and when I get done, you do it. So she just unfolded with all of this stuff. And I'm sitting there like, I got to say something because I don't believe this is accurate. Oh. What you're saying is not right. Like, you know, I know I do that. But but by the time she finished, man, I, I all I could say was I'm sorry. Like, because she was so broken. Wow. She was just, she had, she had laid it all out like, you don't do this. You don't do that. And I just thought that I did. And so, like, when she got done, she had laid it all out. And I just said, I, I forgot about my points. You know, to the, I was just like, I, That's I'm good, sorry. Man. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. And so what, what I, she said, well, I still want to hear your side. So I laid out a few things. But at that point, I realized, I said, this woman is hurting. She's walking around this house feeling like she doesn't even matter. And music is the only thing that matters to me. Wow. Ministry is the only. Yeah. And so, I, I mean, from that day on, I said, I'm going to make her the number one priority. When she talks, I'm going to listen to her. Whatever she says, I'm, I'm going to try to do it right away. And it's changed our marriage. I'm in the best marriage ever, right? Now. You know what I'm saying? Like, like all of that stuff that I thought that 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 I couldn't get from her. Yeah, man, it's like it's easy as cake now because it's like she wants to do for me. It's amazing what happens when we listen. Yeah, because there, most of the things that we need from our spouses, we can get it. Yeah, but we we're standing in front of a bank trying to get a w withdrawal when we've made no deposit. That's it. So the truth is, you got to make sure that you give her what she needs. And she's and wide open. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so you can get what you need. Exactly. And not just so you can get what you need, so that you can be that real dude yeah. that edifies and loves and pampers and nourishes yeah. his wife. Watch this. Just like the church. Yes. Just like Christ loves the church. There you go. And that's what he means. I, 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 you know, I'm learning. I'm learning it, man. Like in the marriage, he, that's why he used those examples. I'm like, man, God, I see what you mean now. Yeah. So like even when she's disrespectful to you, even when she, you feel like this, that, and the other about her, he says you got to love her the same way I love you when you disrespect me. That right there. <laughs> Amen.